and our guest for today's teen talk show is one of the top students from M6 wow. and believe it or not she also has her own vlog channel called It's Piriku. Please welcome Pipiaka! Welcome Pipiaka! from M6 slash 8 and it is a pleasure to be here at Teen Talk today. Welcome. So the hot topic of today's Teen Talk show will be about sports day events. We usually host sports day event every year at ACSP. Okay, so Peep here, could you please give us a little introduction about what happens during sports day? So ACSP sports day usually occur around August to November and it consists of six different colors so there is purple, yellow, blue, red, green, and pink. Wow! So what color are you in? I am in the most iconic color of this year, which is from France, La Vos Violet. Oh, so you're from purple, right? Yes, of course. I saw that purple competed in various different sports as well, and also won the dancing competition that they had. Very amazing. <laughs> yeah, we won a lot of stuff, but actually every team did very well and they all put in a lot of effort. I saw a lot of students like practice till late at night. So yeah. shout out to all of you, you all did a very great job. For sure, for sure. All of these colors played against each other in various different sports like swimming, sprinting, basketball, and soccer. Talking about that now, um, do you actually enjoy any sports yourself? Yes, I like to play basketball and dance. And actually, when I was a child, I actually do a lot more sports like swimming, golf, like that but as I grew up I have a lot more stuff to do for college so yeah I don't get to play a lot of sports anymore well it looks like you were very active and I'm assuming you also joined a few sports competitions right yes I was part of the basketball team and I'm very proud to say that we won the first place this year oh really wow congratulations <laughs> thank you Oh, and also I also got the first place for the 80 meter sprint. Wow, how could you even? You <laughs> took two gold medals back home that day. Wow. Well, since you did participate in both of those already, were there any other sports that you wish you joined? Yes, I actually wanted to try cheerleader because as I said, I like to dance, so it yeah. sounds interesting to me. Yeah, yeah, I see. Well, you know, since I would say cheerleading also looks fun. Now, like maybe can you please tell us about how you felt during the sports day itself, like how the games were or how the mood was overall? Yeah, actually at first at the, like, the preparation stage, it was kind of stressful because as an M6 student, we are the oldest in the school, mm -hmm. so there's a lot of responsibility to take. And so yeah, but after seeing the results on the real day, like the real event, it was pretty worth it because it was fun. Yeah. The parrot was so beautiful to watch. The storyline was great. The clothes were so amazing. It was fantastic. The cheerleader performance was also very good. And during the competition, when the when the students were competing with each other, like everyone was cheering for them. Yeah. It was yeah. Yeah, definitely. And um, talking about that now, this is also your last sports day that you'll be um, attending, right? Sadly, like we missed out on a couple years since like the pandemic and stuff like that. So how does it feel like being back again this year? Um, actually, like um, I was pretty sad that there wasn't any sports day during when I was in M5. But yeah, at least it is back. Like I was very sad because sports day is very, a very big event, a very big school event. So yeah, I feel like I missed out a big part of my high school life, but yeah, at least it's okay. It's okay. Yeah, I understand that because I also felt like the same as you and probably every student also felt the same. I'm sure like they're all happy that they're back again uh, together and having fun together, you know. Well, uh, we're closing in to the end of the interview now. Is there anything that you would like to add to this now? Yeah, sure. So for this sports day, I felt very good about it because I enjoyed it and I hope that all of you enjoyed it as much as I do as well. And for the next sports day event to come, I would like to encourage everyone to participate and have fun with it because yeah, yeah it's a good time to be with your friends and stuff. Exactly. And also if you can try to take the leadership roles because 
yeah, it might be hard, but you will gain a lot from it, from it as well. Yeah. Also, for sports day, teamwork and unity is very important because teamwork makes the dream work. Teamwork makes the dream work. Right, right. Peepure, since you're here already, don't you want to talk a little bit about your vlog channel as well since that we mentioned earlier? Oh, okay, sure. So I have a YouTube channel called It's Pure Rico. Wow. Uh, it's a YouTube channel that I made with my friends because we are in our last year of high school and we thought that it is a good idea to film something together and keep it as a memory. That's a very good idea. Well, please go ahead and subscribe to our channel guys. Again, it's uh, at It's Pure Wow. Feel free to go and subscribe. Alright, that is the end of our Teen Talk show today. Thank you so much Pure for joining and I hope everyone enjoyed the show today. If anyone wants us to feature a student on our show again, feel free to drop down the, in the comments below and let us know who you want. Also, for the latest news, please visit our Facebook page at We Love EP Facebook page and ACSP English Program YouTube channel. Don't forget to click the like button, subscribe, and share the video with your friends. Bye bye!